This week on Tips, Tricks, and Practice Routines, how do they do it? How do some of these top players that we've all seen throw so consistently over and over? Besides a lot of practice, each of them has something they do that feels comfortable to them, and they pr most likely do it over and over again. Uh, I've preached this a little bit in some of the earlier videos. One of the most important things is you've got to be comfortable. You've got to be comfortable in the box, whether you stand, whether you step. Those type of things really is a variable, and it's, it depends on how you feel comfortable. But there are some things that, that you kind of you have to follow through with. And I think it's it kind of across the board, a lot of players, you know, they have to do for consistency. One of the top things is follow through. You've got to completely follow through with the bag, with your arm stroke. None of this T-Rexing stuff, that's what I call it, short arming it, where you have a crease in your arm. You want to extend that arm and you want to follow through. An additional little tool that I've added to my throw to help me, because some of these players, I don't know how they do it. They will follow through and they'll end up, they'll end up over here. Or they have all kinds of different releases when they're completely done. None of that worked for me, so I've kind of developed a little thing for myself. And it's also a correction tool. It helps me correct my throw. When I'm finished with my follow through, I will leave my arm out like this. I'm basically looking straight down my arm, kind of like you're looking down the sight of the barrel of a gun. Just like that. I leave that extension out there so I can tell, am I in line? Now if I come through and I'm off just a little bit, which happens, I know why. I am not releasing in my own sight right down the street. Again, off to this side. The bag's going to go over there because that's where I'm throwing it. Just leave that arm out there just a little extra second or two as a gu helpful guide that will help you train, to be, train yourself to be just a little bit more consistent. Now, hopefully this tip helps today. Uh, it, it helped me because a lot of the different throws, I mean, just like everybody else, you know, I have followed players, I've watched players to pick up different things that work for them. They may or they may not work for you. Try different techniques and styles, and hopefully this one will help you throw that bag just a little straighter.